Okay, let's go with my options again. Great. All right, so obviously the goal is the NBA, but the question is, how do we get there? Now, we could declare for the draft right now and take our chances. Get drafted as an afterthought in the second round, or not at all, ruin my career. Doesn't sound good. Yeah, I'm not into none of that, Rick. Okay, well then we could do college, or G League. Right? Okay, since you're still hesitant, maybe you need a new perspective. Right, lucky for you, I got a couple guys lined up that might be able to talk both options with you. <laughs> hey, look at you, Mr. Manager. Way to leverage those connects, bro. You act like I ain't been networking since kindergarten. True. <laughs> <laughs> look, anyway, I got you a meeting with Che. Play for Porter Che? Mm -hmm. You know him, bro? Nah, he knows you. He's a fan of the channel. I hit him up on socials, he responded immediately. Yo, that's what's up, bro. Look, he said he'd love to talk with you about college. I mean, obviously with him being a four-year guy who went through a lot, he knows better than most. Yo, word. Yeah. Yeah, I also got you a meeting with AI to talk about G League. Allen Iverson. Wait. Allen Iverson. No. You got me a meeting with AI, bro? That's some name? No, 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 what? no. What's the, up? The other AI. Oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. You know, I get that too. Yeah. Look, hey, I saw he was playing for the team Ignite now. I guess he into that whole mentor thing, huh? Yeah, yeah. He's really done a lot of growing up over the years. You know what, man? I appreciate you taking the time to set this all up, bro. That's, that's nice of you, bro. <laughs> Look. I'm not gonna make no money as your manager if you're selling unlocked cell phones out the back of a barbershop, you know? <laughs> Heartwarming. <laughs> Look, you know, if you wanna get a little run in while you think it over, you should hit up some of the courts around the city. I mean, they got some great ballers out there. Good pickup games. Hey, I, hey, look, I'm gonna check that out, bro. But for real, I, I appreciate you putting all this together for me, bro. That's major, fam. Like I said, man, I can't have you flipping burgers. I like burgers, though, bro. You know the ones no, with no, the cheese, stop. the bacon. Go. Go talk to Che, go talk to AI, get your mind right, and then come back and we can talk business. So you don't want no burger? No, just go. I'm leaving. Yeah, right? MP, what up, baby? Nice to meet you, man. Look, I appreciate you talking to me. Hey, no problem, bro. Your boy Ricky sent over your tape, man. I gotta say, you got a little game. I got a little game? Just a little bit. I, I appreciate mean, that. you could use some work, not gonna lie, but the potential's there, man. I think the G League would be good for you. Put me up on game. Why, why you think that? All right, so check this out, man. Like, the G League is different from when I was coming up. Okay. Like, I didn't have all my stuff together back then. It was, it was a different road. Like, like, you know I'm playing for Team Ignite, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah, so. Yeah. So we didn't have anything like that back then. Like it was kind of a every man for himself sort of vibe. But now Team Ignite is basically designed to help top prospects play at a pro level, right? Yeah. So that's why I signed with them. Like I want to help the next generation learn the way that I was taught by my mentors. Hey man, I, re I respect that. I yeah. really do. Yeah. Not to mention, I mean, you're already a pro, so you're free to pursue whatever opportunities that you can get, man, assuming that you can play at a level that sponsors want to look at you. Hey, I, I hear you, bro. What the what the money look like? Oh, it's good. It's good? It's good, bro. That's dope, man. Do you, you got any regrets about that first route you took? I mean, not really, man. Like, everything okay. that happened to me is kind of what made me who I am. But I will say, man, it's difficult, right? Like, they expect you to play like a pro, yeah. right? So you got to give it your full commitment, no exceptions. They will cut you from the roster like that. Oof, that's... That's the sense, bro. Yeah, yeah, it can be. Um, you got anything else you want to tell me? Well, you know, G League is way different from college, right. right? Like, you got better facilities, better training, better access, and all that sort of thing. And you need to learn how to train your body like a pro, okay? So get in the gym, get your workouts in, get that muscle up, all that sort of thing. You're going to take that knowledge with you for the rest of your career. Hey, I, I'm always looking for a way to get an edge, man. That's, that sounds good to me. That's good, bro. Well, listen, I got to get going, but if you got any other questions, man, feel free to reach out. Your boy Ricky knows how to contact me. I appreciate that. Look, I appreciate you, AI. Thank you. No problem, bro. Hey, keep working on your game, man. It's a long road ahead.
Che, right? Yo, man, I'm a big fan. I'm MP, bro. Hey, what's good with you, little Wody? Nice to meet you, man. Hey, look, thank you for taking the time to talk to me. Seriously, bro. Oh, it's all good. I'm a big fan of your work. So <laughs> happy to help any way I can. So your boy Ricky said you had some questions about college, right? Yeah, man, look, we just... I'm weighing a lot of options, and I think I need somebody to just help me walk through this, this college route, you know? Hey, I'm a big fan of college, man. Yeah. I had my ups and downs, but I ended up staying all the way up to my senior year. Oh, yeah, I remember that. But even if I left early for the league, I would still recommend it. And why's that? Nothing's gonna help you grow as a player like college, man. You find the right program that really knows how to nurture your gifts, you'll develop like crazy. And the whole point of college is development. <laughs> I like that. You said, you said something about important programs, right? What you looking for there? Well, different schools are good with different things. Some are great with big men. Okay. Some pump out defenders year after year, and others know how to open up your scoring. So it really depends on your, your gifts and, you know, your swagger and where you want to go with it. You got any drawbacks? Obviously, there's, there's injury. I know you saw what happened with my guy, Porter Rose. Yeah. That was my dude. But you can get hurt tomorrow, man, playing at the park. So that really didn't factor into my decision. Hey, look, you speaking nothing but facts, bro. Fair <laughs> enough, yeah. And nothing's like the atmosphere of college, man. What? Yeah, the crowd, the campus. You're like a, a god there, MP. I like that. It's a good way to really get acclimated into the spotlight, man. I ain't really in the shadows, though, bro. I got a million on the social. <laughs> I peep your socials, man. You okay. got it. But look, it's a traditional route for a reason. You want to go to the NBA? You want to be a star? College is your best bet by a lot, I'm telling you. Even after everything that you've been through, you still feel that way? Yeah. Even after what I went through, I wouldn't change the way I handled it. And it doesn't take away from what I learned or how I developed there. How you develop? You keep talking about development, yo. That's a word, Jay. Yeah. <laughs> I appreciate you, bro. Seriously. Hey, it's all good, man. Look, if you got any more questions, holler at me on the socials, all right? I got you. Or get my number from Ricky. Let's get some gumbo in New Orleans soon. <laughs> hey, I got you, bro. All right. I believe you. Thank you, man. Okay, so uh, what's this? Uh, uh. Okay. What's this urgent matter you gotta talk to me about? I never said urgent, learn to read. No, learn to communicate. Learn to appreciate me. Learn to recognize when your best friend who clearly loves and respects you is just giving you a hard time, bro. Chill out. Oh, I love when you get all sentimental. You know, it's adorable. No, 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 no. I think you mean sophisticated, mature, not afraid to be vulnerable. Different things, bro. Definitely adorable. All right, so look. I've been working on setting up this My Hub app for you. You can actually access it through the TV. Oh, that's what you've been working on. Yeah, look, it's a productivity app that I downloaded, all right? All right, now, it's still in beta, so there might still be some bugs, but let you keep track of all kinds of stuff from the same screen. Hey, good looking out, Rick. Yeah, so anytime you got something important to attend to, it'll be on this screen. I mean, season schedules, endorsement opportunities, important social messages. Yo, that's, that's dope, bro. I appreciate you setting that up. That's fire. Yeah, man. Now, you know, you'll actually have to play some real games to get endorsement opportunities and schedules, which actually brings me to my next point. Uh, you ever hear of someone named Chip Seymour? Chip Seymour. Yeah, yeah, he's on the flex, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think somebody had him tuned in at 98.9 at the park yesterday. Yeah, he's like the morning drive guy, but yeah. Look, check this out, man. 
everyone in the city is talking about our newest resident MP. The basketball sensation who moved here to do uh, what exactly? He hasn't declared for college. He hasn't signed with the G League team. He hasn't done anything to prove he takes his basketball career seriously since winning a few games in high school against a bunch of future pickup ballers. Now, I'm a fan of basketball, the sport, and it's played at the highest level in the NBA, not on social. So until MP starts doing something to prove he's serious about the game, I'm going to keep on not caring about what he does. Disagree with me? Give us a call and we'll talk about it. You're listening to Chip Samuel on 98.9 The Flex. Okay, so some boomer on the radio don't get what we about. What's new, Rick? All right, that dude is a clown, yes, but look, he's right about this, bro. Like, you got to make a decision soon, or the public perception of you is going to shift in a way that even I'm not going to be able to fix. I hear you. What's up? All right, look, I'm ready to make a decision. You serious? Like, you finally put your big boy pants on. I don't like the way you said big boy pants. Man pants. That's somehow worse, bro. Okay, are you ready to be the decision daddy? Bro. <laughs> look, you brought this on yourself, all right? You dragged this out for so long, so just spit it out. What do you want to do? Fam, I want to go to college. Look, that's the path I always seen for myself. I think that's the right call. <laughs> Learn your craft, yeah. build your draft stock, and then declare when you're ready. Exactly. All right, so you're 100% here. I mean, because it's not a good look to back out if you sign with a program. Yeah. Look, this is what I want. Okay. So who's going to be lucky enough to add MP to their team this fall, huh? Hey! <laughs> Great choice. Man, I feel good about it. I think it's the perfect program to take your game to the next level. Look, I'm gonna send him your letter of intent and get the ball rolling. Look, that's what's up. Yo, what we do next? I don't know, go hit the gym or something. Like, next thing you know, the semester gonna be starting and the season will be here. Hey, look, I'm always ready, son. <laughs> well, that's great, my son, I'm proud of you. How you gonna be proud of me when you my son, son? That's weird, because I distinctly remember you being my son. Oh, that's crazy, because that's wrong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 